Do you know there is a fish that holds its babies into its mouth? One kilogram of tilapia fish can cost like $10. On the other hand, one kilogram of peacock or Malawi chiclet can cost up to $200 to $400. You can easily take a good car or buy a good home for your family if you're into this fish culture business. Welcome everyone to my vlog. Today I am standing right now in one of the biggest chiclet farms in Thailand. Today in this video I am going to show you how they breed these chiclets. They have Malawi chiclets, African chiclets and they also have peacock chiclets. I make you see some of them, just see the colors. These are really beautiful, really nice. Let you see the entire farm, what fish they have, what fish, how they breed, how they rear the fish and how they pack and how they export everything. This is an export oriented chiclet farm. So we have so many varieties of chiclets. Stay tuned in this video. Wow, can you see the, see the chiclets in the ponds? The water is so clear, I guess you can see the chiclets clearly. And here we have blue sulfur head, yellow sulfur head, OB peacock, different different varieties of chiclets. Here we have more. Yes, strawberries. This is the size basically that this size runs in export better. You can put so many fish this is two inch okay two inch size you can put so many fish in a bag if the fish is two inch size so the two inch size fish sells more exports more here you can make an estimation about the value or cost of this fish like if you think about one kilogram of tilapia two inch size how much could be that cost one kg of tilapia the fish we used to eat could cost approximately like 10 USD per kg, right? But in this case, the peacock chiclet, it costs like at least 10 to 20 times higher than that. It costs like 200 to 300 USD per kg. Wow, now you can understand how expensive these fish are. See the strain, the chiclets are different, right? different color these are actually pink peacock chiclets see their colors oh my god these are actually families chiclet families from malawi and just see their colors so many different lake malawi chiclets they have right here another one very very beautiful chiclet let me show you yes just see the color i'm not sure maybe two or three colors in the body of this fish but that looks really cute want to see the big chiclets here we have the big size chiclets these are four inch these are four inch chiclets these are four inch size and now i will show you how they breed or where they rear their fries the pond you are seeing now one two three four five six seven eight nine ten okay ten large ponds these are large ponds like uh, 30 feet length and 20 feet in width and the water height is also great. I mean, minimum of three feet height and they are growing chiclets in this pond. Uh, I think I can show the chiclet babies in this pond. You can see the babies, right? The babies are less colorful and it's completely normal that babies are less colorful. In this pond, you people can see the small chiclets baby and they are coming. They are coming to my hand, see. 
they are not even afraid and so many babies so many so many babies probably uh, probably 20,000 or 30,000 babies has to be in this pond one single pond 20 to 30,000 babies so how much that is the quantity they can produce so uh, if we come to the next pond here you can see all the ponds are filled up with babies this pond we see three inch different varieties of chiclets they are three inch they are not babies they are three inch and if we come forward oh my goodness see how much crowded the pond is how many chiclet you think could be in this pond please comment me please comment me in the comment section below that how much chiclet do you think in this pond here are also some ponds holding so many baby chiclets yes i guess you people can see the chiclet babies in the cameras see how many of them in one single pond amazing amazing and also different different varieties in there chiclets and chiclets come hmm. so what i was basically saying is like most of the chiclets you see here are mouth brooders you know what mouth brooders chiclet is basically chiclet breeds in two different types or two different categories one is mouth brooder and one is not mouth brooder basically the mouth brooder one uh, keeps eggs after fertilizing the eggs in the breeding process they keep eggs into the mouth and they hatch their eggs into their own mouth and after hatching the eggs they release the fry from their mouth that is what called mouth brooder chiclets so the chiclets you see here most of the fishes are mouth brooders okay and the chiclet those are not mouth brooders the hatching process is almost the same but they don't carry their eggs into their mouth so here most of the chiclets are mouth brooder so if you want to breed them you need to understand which one is male which one is female you also need to give a aquarium with a male female ratio like three is to one i mean three females one males that is the ratio you need to maintain after that they will breed and you will see that they keep their eggs into their mouth so this is basically the one side of the farm and now i am moving to the other side of the farm as well i am going to the breeding corner now be with me i'm gonna show you the actual footage of chiclet moms holding their babies inside their mouth this is probably the parents and maybe we are about to see their babies okay 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 close shot asha oh the babies oh my god can you see the babies inside its mouth okay can this is another can i oh no but eggs 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 this is the eggs okay that's why i was telling you people that these are mouth brooders can we check another house yes yes go now you see practically how it works this is mouth brooder and the parents fish used to keep their eggs and babies inside their mouth another pond where he has so many babies maybe these all are parents you know and maybe they all carries baby in their mouth now we are about to see another pond let's see this pond ob let okay okay ob red okay okay see the fish male see the fish yes male and female yes yeah. have babies ekta dhore dekhi baby ache neki 
No. This one does not have any baby. Can I check another one? No baby. This one have egg. See the egg. See? Okay, okay. I was trying to ask him that after how many days he used to collect the baby from the parent's mouth. Yes. He said that he used to collect the babies from the parents' mouth every 20 days. That is because if he does not collect the babies, the parents usually eat their own babies. See the color of this fish. They are really dark strawberry color. This is called OB. Yes, right. And these are all four inch. I am telling the viewers again that if you really like chiclet, you want to import chiclet, your location doesn't matter. We export chiclets to everywhere around the world. I mean, in the US, uh, in the Canada, in Europe, anywhere you can import fish from us. So oh, this is another category of chiclet you can see. Oh, see the color, how colorful they are how different they are, different cichlids, okay, okay, so the Malawi you have, I have two in, uh, two in Malawi, yeah. two in, yes. two in. can I see, okay, from, from Tosa. This is Malawi male. Yeah, yeah. Malawi male. This is Obi. Obi albino. Obi albino. Yeah. This one, right? Mm. This one is Obi albino. This is Fontosa. Yes, good head, this one. Good head. Frontosa bulandi. Frontosa bulandi. This is Frontosa bulandi and this also Frontosa bulandi. This is the food. They give them it. This is the basic food they used to give their fish. And this is the food that brings out very beautiful color of this Malawi chiclets. So this has to be the end of this video. I just wondered that how they breed so many chiclets and it's just amazing how they do this. And please, 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 if you like my video, please subscribe my channel, like this video and also share this video as well. This is the only way you can support me so that I can make more videos like that. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. Take care.
এখন আমি আপনাদেরকে মাছগুলো আর একটু ভালোভাবে দেখাই নাও আই এম গোয়িং টু শো ইউ দ্য ফিশ বেটার This is Obi, right? Obi. This is uh, 8 baht. Yes, 8 baht. 8 baht. Okay. Can I see this? দেখেন কত ধরনের চিকলে দিস ইজ অলসো এইট বাস আমি পরে না গেলে হয় পানির ভেতরে দিস ইজ ইলেকট্রিক ব্লু রাইট This is blue peacock. Yeah. This is blue peacock. Dark blue ekebare. Dark blue. Okay. This is also 8 baht. 8 baht. Okay. Then the yellow one. This is the yellow one, okay. And the red one. This this one is eight baht. Yeah. Okay. And this is the pink. Pink peacock. This is pink peacock. Really dark pink. And this is and laka ten baht. Ten baht. Yes. Okay. Okay. Two inch.